Hello Pisces, welcome on my channel, Triple Two Tarot, and today I'm doing your weekly general love reading. This is for Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus in Pisces. This is a general love reading, so take what resonates with you and leave the rest. These messages cannot be re resonate with everyone. I'm using this beautiful romantic tarot deck. This is my favorite, but the you know the pictures on this um, in this every deck on this deck and cards is like very beautiful. But this is a lot like very. The art is very beautiful, the pictures are beautiful, but it's also light, you can't see it very clearly, you know. But I love this deck. So I, I, I'm, I'm definitely using it for Pisces. So let's see Pisces, what's happening for you in your love life, what's happening. You can come to me for personal reading if you want to, details are given on my channel. You can follow me on Instagram and Facebook, triple two channel, I will truly appreciate it guys. Again, this is a general love reading. Take what resonates with you. The people who will say blah, 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 you will be blocked. I'm so sorry. Be humble and be kind to understand. You are adult enough to understand this is a general reading and this is only predictions. It's not a guarantee. So if it resonates with you, this is for you. If it's not, then this is not your story. Okay. Let's see, Pisces, what is coming for you. I will pick up um, your energy, like recent past. And then currently what happening and what is the possible outcome between you and this person, right? Whoever you are dealing with. So let's see what's happening for my Pisces. Energy could be vice versa if you're a cross watcher or if you are a Pisces. I will just pick up the energies here that what's going on between two people, two souls. Okay, let's see. Okay, please spirit guide me for my Pisces. What's happening? What happened in the recent past? Recently what happened with my Pisces? Okay, cards are not going to pop up. What you guys are doing, huh? Okay. <laughs> Here you go. So this was what you were doing there. Okay. Yes. Yes, honey. Okay. I got this. I got this from my Pisces. Let's see what's happening in your recent, present moment. Okay, current moment, your current energy in the present. What's happening with the Pisces? What's happening with my Pisces? Okay, do you want to come, baby? Hmm. Okay, I love it. Love it. Yes. Oh, wow. What is the possible outcome for Pisces and the person they're dealing with? It's here. I love these beautiful decks. I'm like, look at this. What's happening here? Here you are, Pisces. Here you are. Let's see bottom of the deck what you have. You have three of wands. Okay. Look how beautiful these cards are. Three of wands could be dealing with Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. So what's happening for Pisces here, your overall energy here, and then you have ten of wands. Yes, you have ten of wands. And then you have three of wands. So definitely, this is your overall energy. I'm seeing here the ten of wands. You're releasing your burden. You're definitely not into that energy anymore. That you feel like it's draining your energy. It's really making you stressful, anxiety, whatever it is. And then you have three of wands. It's look like now you are definitely looking your future more positively. You're waiting for your future. You're releasing something behind because you feel like this is not worthy. You know, this is not the worth relationship or situation, whatever situation, whatever you are in or a complicated relationship. Whatever it is, you feel like this is draining your energy and you can't put the energy anymore in that. Then three of wands, you're definitely waiting for something positive in your future. You're looking um, your future and your current energy now very positively. So what happened recently, what you did here, you have the full card. That is you could be dealing with Aries. Look at this. This is like new journey. You started something new. Okay. You are definitely jumping into new things. You're moving forward. You're accepting, you're trusting the process, you're looking forward for future. 
okay you are just jumping into future unknown you know unknown you don't know the what will future bring to you but you are positive about it somehow uh, for some of Pisces this is also the fool is also like soul you know soul journey and you are definitely more healing um, you are looking for yourself you are you are going within yourself very deep and deep you are looking the answer within yourself because you're not finding in uh, you know around you that you wanted to know the answers but this is you happily after look at this you're embracing the journey you're good you're feeling good you're top on the world and you start in you you have the justice card could be dealing with um how to say this libra the justice card so you feel like if someone did injustice with you okay the god the universe will definitely bring the justice within you I also feel like with the justice here now you are balancing your life. Look at this. You're not unstable anymore. You are into balance. This is your recent past, by the way, what you did in the past recently, okay? You definitely got your balance in your life. Now you are being logical. You're moving forward, embracing the new journey, jumping into new things, doing new things, hobbies, something like that. Because you're making your balance, you're, you're making your way balance, okay? You don't want to be unstable anymore. Like, you don't want to be on the crossroad, like, what should I do, what should I not? You know what you have to do. You know that what you have done, okay? Then you have the chariot. Yeah, you did this. Could be dealing with cancer. You have all three major arcana in your recent past. It means that something big happened already in your recent past. You already choose the path to move forward. You can see that this is you. Now you're moving forward. You know, the chariot in a normal tarot deck definitely is the, the universe is behind him and he's moving forward and he's looking for the star. Star is talking talk about definitely destiny. And you are already with the three of wands looking for your destiny. You're moving forward day by day, step by step towards your destiny. Because you know that what happened is was draining your energy and you can't stay there. You can't be imbalanced there. You need to move forward and you are doing it. For some of you, I feel like uh, you are um, you recently got abroad into different city or different country i don't know some somehow some of you people get uh, you know i see the traveled because i see the travel cards here could be you are dealing with someone who live on the distance from you but this has happened recently or you got the message from someone yeah for some of pisces you already got the recently message from someone and they are coming for a second chances because they live on the distance you already this is for some of you okay, not for everyone they got the justice because someone bring the justice you know you you, this is your choice if you will accept them or not but someone from your past come up to you but you are already moving forward with the chariot and they come up to you they show you the interest like they want another chance because the fool is also another chances someone wants another chance from you and the justice is now served to you because someone did injustice to you and now it's happening here but it's your choice you want to accept them or you want to move forward but i for mostly i feel like for some of you you already choose your path to move forward and you are believing on the destiny and universe to saying that somehow somehow someday you will definitely get the justice balancing your life what happening real recent your current energy here you have the hangman this is your pisces look at this how you're hanging there you're patiently waiting for the right time perfect timing perfect person you're mr right i don't say that nobody's perfect here i would not say perfect i would say perfect timing to meet your mr right or miss right nobody is also perfect nobody's perfect even we are not perfect but it looks like you're definitely patiently now waiting for someone who mean to be in your life it's like your your destiny yes and on the hangman with the also you have the taurus card here this is the head of hand could be dealing with taurus so i feel for some of you definitely look 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 at this how you started your soul journey how you started your healing journey this is you alignment connecting with your soul connecting with the society connecting with the god all the higher self it's like you're connecting with your god with your higher energy with your higher self it's you it's you. Nobody can stop you now. You know the answers. You're healing. You're day by day evolving. The next you have the Capricorn card. Oh my God, the devil is here. But she's here. It's she's woman. Look at this. How she's beautiful. Yeah, the devil. Um, could be dealing with Capricorn. But uh, I'm seeing here that you're losing. You're you're breaking the chains. You know the devil is a you know to change people and love connection lust is there codependence energy there like you are depending on someone that they love you they they come towards you you are breaking this chain 
you are breaking this chain you are not obsessed with them anymore you are not addicted to them anymore because you are understanding that these things cannot bring you something that you want it's like you're letting go of everything that is not serving you that's beautiful okay that's beautiful um what is a possible outcome between you and that person or it could be someone new is coming in your way let's see you have the king of want aries leo sagittarius you have queen of pentacles this is you pisces shining there look at this strong lady doesn't matter if you're male you are getting strong you're you're independent now because you are definitely releasing these chains break, breaking from this energy who were holding you back Mm -mm, you're not in that energy anymore queen of pentacles and here you are the high priestess this is you also pisces and then you have the ten of cups this is you pisces cancer scorpio now i will tell you what is this here for some of you i don't see that the person you are dealing with they are coming towards you could be because the king of wand is there someone is looking at you as like their future partner because you are here with the queen of pentacles shining glowing into your power you're not you are not available for right now any relationship you're allowing the universe with the high priestess that bring the right person in your life this is you focusing on your business on you but queen of pentacle for more uh, i feel like this is you um you are more strong now you are more powerful now you are more healthy now like you are into healthy vibration in a, in a very very high vibration tuning into your intuitions listening to your intuitions allowing with universe allowing with the guides you're trusting your guides you're trusting your intuitions your guts that whatever is coming in your way that will definitely bring you happiness bring you joy and you will be happy you are also happy right now look at this you're not worried and for anything this is you pisces glowing shining into your power very strong independent woman i feel like this is you and you're attracting this king of wand i don't know this is the same person or this is the new person because we don't have any clue here king of wand someone is attracting to you because they're seeing you a marriage material they're seeing you a wifey material they're they're getting attracted to you because they are feeling your high vibration this person is also into high vibration this person is also very sexy, charming, could be younger than you, could be older than you, but I see more likely you, more older than you. This person also, I see the kids here, look at this. This person definitely seeing you as like, they are seeing the potential of a marriage with you. They want to marry you, they want to make children with you because I'm seeing the children. And again, I'm feeling with this vibe with this person, whoever this person here is, this person don't fall for anyone. Like it's very hard to catch this person i feel like this person could be a player like they're always into a playful energy hard working this is giving me aries vibe here i could be leo obviously this is a fire sign leo sagittarius but this person is giving me aries vibe here this person is attracting to you like this businessman planning about the future do the right thing and with the queen of pentacles you are glowing like this person definitely is like opposite attracting each other you can see that it's like opposite attracting each other whoever this person here is could be they are opposite from you totally opposite and they're falling for you ten of cups look at this this person definitely want to marry you ten of cups i feel more like pisces okay i was also seeing that other scenario this is you pisces um okay taking your control of your life as a king of wand moving forward queen of pentacles organizing your business making yourself balance into healing energy trusting your intuitions trusting your intuitions your guides and then ten of cups making being happy within yourself ten of cups happy enjoying with your friends enjoying with your family enjoying with your pets doing work ten of cups everything you're doing making you happy right now because you are into your high vibration this is for those people who are those pisces who are not dealing with anyone and you are recently definitely end up with someone like you already said goodbye to the past and now this is you shining glowing healing you are into power you are into high vibration energy uh, you are breaking all the chains addictions obsession and you are allowing the universe to bring the right person in your life. This is you. And for others of you, I feel like someone is getting attractive to you. They are definitely attracting to you because they feel like you are into high vibration. You are their match. They are totally opposite, by the way, whoever this person here is. They are falling for you. 
but I want to get clarity that who is this king of wands because I'm uh, definitely, you know, it's a Pisces reading. I want to know that who is this king of. Uh, please spirit, uh, clear me this. Okay, okay. Oh wow! <laughs> oh my god! I mean, guys, this is not me. I I never played these things. I this is already happened with the spirit and the guides. Everything is coming here. Um, this is Ace of Cups, bottom of the deck, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. So this is totally new love here and you have Knight of Wands. Again, someone is coming towards you. I was telling you guys, I was want to clear this, that who is this King of Wands? Because this person is giving me like vibe like, mmm, they are seeing you. Look at this. Um, this person is seeing you like, like you. You are like you. It looks like you are for this person. Like they want to taste you. Yummy. They feel like you are yummy, Pisces. And this person is not only like want to taste you. You understand me? <laughs> oh yeah, you understand me. This person want to taste like they want to. They want to grab you, like um, hold you uh, in their arms and something like that. They want to feel you. Whoever this person here is. Could be a recent, could be this is a past person, but I, because this is for some of you, this is totally uh, new because Ace of Cups, I, I would say new, Ace of Cups, Ace of Cups, this is totally new, uh, someone is falling in love with you, someone definitely want to be with you, like they are, they are, they are seeing you like their eyes are only on you like you you are the one and first priority for this person like they're seeing you like they want to feel you they want to taste you they're seeing that you're yummy pisces i don't know who is this person and this is not only like they want to feel you they want to taste you as an idol wand could be a younger fire sign Aries, leo sagittarius fire energy very strongly here could be this is the same person that you have a history with you can see that because the wild card is here oh my god what is this the wild card is here could be this is the same person that you have history with a lot of cycles and it's looked like a completion of a cycle okay so this has always happened you know this is how law uni universe work when you are into high vibration you moved on from someone that person the universe bring that person back in your life ah i don't want to say that but yes someone from the past is coming with a wild card the cycle is completed they already completed the cycle they're done with their karma you done with your karma whatever is happening you are into high vibration and this person is also coming towards you knight of wands they're awakening ace of cups they're falling in love knight of wands and they want to offer you like they're saying pisces i'm ready because you are into your high vibration now and this person is also done their work whatever they did they're coming for some of you this is totally new person that you are already completed the cycle uh -uh, you say the goodbye to the past someone is here seeing you and falling in love with you they're very very attractive to you knight of wands could be a charmer i was telling you this person don't fall for anyone knight of wands very very charmer a very big charmer like very handsome good looking if she's a female wow you can see the beauty the pure beauty with the ace of cups and knight of wands pure beauty beauty sexy eyes sexy body and if this is a male wow you're lucky this person was onto a spiritual journey as you were pisces i feel this person is coming towards you this is to, for some of you this is totally new person falling in love with you i don't want to say that okay the world you already completed the cycle just take what resonates with you for others of you i feel like this is the person that you had history with with the wild card you already completed the cycle this person was also completing the cycle in their life they were doing their own things dealing on things and finally they are here to offer you love ace of cups knight of wands they're rushing in into your life because they are seeing that you are glowing you are shining now yeah ten of cups ace of cups to ten of cups you will be very very happy if this is new or if this is the same person i don't know Pisces, you will be happy with the Ace of Cups and Ten of Cups. Totally emotional fulfillment. It's, it's look like your wish is coming true. It's like Ace of Cups to Ten of Cups. The whole. This person will make you whole, completed, emotionally fulfilled. Yes. So congratulations. I really hope it resonated with you guys. Let me know in the comments. I will truly appreciate it. Thank you so much. God bless you in your journey. Love you guys. See you later. God bless you.